listen. 3,000. What's going on, everybody? I am Caesar. I am Zen. And we are Listen 3,000. And uh, this is episode... 30. 20. I was about to say 29. Nah, oh, this is 30. Go. Yes. Deserve the uh -uh for sure today. <laughs> um, and yeah, before we get into our very special guest that we have today... Um, we always have to give a shout out to the Sound Gallery Studios. It is a event space and a recording studio. So come book either or at this lovely space. And thank you for always having us. This is also a uh, podcast be that is being presented to you by Agents of Fandom. Fandom. Yes, Agents of Fandom. Always Agents of Fandom. Agents of Fandom. <laughs> we need a, a little drum no, for Agents them now yeah, We'll yeah, like so make yeah. a song for them or something. Yeah, definitely. There we go. Make sure you check out AgentsOfFandom.com. Check out all the other podcasts on the network, including Agents of Fandom yes, yes. and Fandom Academy. And take it to reality. So, yeah. yeah, shout out to the whole Ages of Fandom family. For sure. Yeah. And like, comment, subscribe. Yes. Thank you. Yes, thank you for that. I was off. Man. Come on, I'm right. Bang, 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 there bang. You go. Look at this go to <laughs> Episode 30. We're trying to yes. get it together. Yes, now. Yes. So, yes. yeah. Um, Would you like to introduce? Yes, 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 yeah, yeah, yeah. Yes, yes. So, we got, we, got, uh, we got one of the, to me, one of the, the premier people on YouTube that talk, talks about comics, breaks them down for people Absolutely. that's not... Uh, Everyday readers of the comic books, he fills you in. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. Like he, he gets you up to date on everything that's happening. Yep. We got our guy Ernie from Blur Without Fear. <laughs> Wait, oh. that <laughs> Jesus. There you go. <laughs> Had to get it right. <laughs> Sorry about that. Hey, you know, honestly, that 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 intro was still better than I would have been able to introduce myself. So come on, man. Oh, that's beautiful. Don't do that. Don't, yeah, stop it, please. <laughs> Look at he doing. He throwing the compliment. Yeah, right, I see right. what we was <laughs> okay. I see what you're doing. I see what you're doing. No, nah, but we really appreciate you for coming on, man. We're so excited to have you. No, nah, definitely, man. Yeah. And we got some questions for you it. first before we get into uh, just some news, right? Yes, yes. So you want to start? So off? I'm um, ready, man. Hit, hit me, hit me with the the, the toughest. Let's get, Ooh, let's <laughs> let's get it. Um, so yeah, um, you've been one of the the premier comic book YouTube people in this space. Mm -hmm. um, what got you to this point? Because you know, I, I think I. I ran the, we came up on my algorithm and I've been rocking with you since then. Cause like you really keep you, you, your perspective on comic books is very unique to me. Um, so how did you get started? Like getting into this, you know? So, um, it's happened a lot of different ways, but probably the, the, the one that I feel like actually got me there is, um, getting kicked out of my band. Wow. Uh, <laughs> wow. Now you got to oh, break that down. Real. I'm about to say, you got to get real. Let's get into it. I'm prepared for story time. I'm about to take my jacket off. All right. <laughs> no, um, no, I, I was, um, uh, I used to uh, do music. I uh, used to be a vocalist for um, yes. a uh, progressive metal band uh, oh, oh. here in uh, my city of Memphis, Tennessee. And um, we were kind of doing pretty good. We were... You know, we had kind of we were in kind of in the final stages of uh, tightening up what I guess would have effectively been like a first EP. Wow, nice! And um, I got kicked out for Dang. having a very poor attitude uh, towards uh, how we were making our music. <laughs> Wow. <laughs> so uh, it, it, it was that, uh, which honestly, to be fair, as I, with the, the benefit of time looking back, yes, I was a diva. Uh, <laughs> so I, I don't even fault them for that. I, I don't even fault them for kicking me out and replacing me. I, I, I would have done it too. Gotcha. Uh, gotcha. But I needed a creative outlet and uh, music uh, was my creative outlet so once uh i just kind of sat down i was like man i want to you know do something with my free time so i started um i started with my what was effectively my first youtube channel don't look it up um it was terrible <laughs> and uh it was awful it was terrible i don't really even like talking about it uh but it was like it was a combination website and youtube channel and I was trying to do way too much. I was trying to be the guy that's like, yeah, I'm going to talk about all the video games and the comics and the movies and TV shows. <laughs> I burned myself out real right, fast. Right, right, right. Um, and eventually I was like, you know what? I really love board games. Let me do. I see these channels doing something about board games. I want to do something kind of like that. Cause you, you, and then I got bored with that. Uh, because I was also getting back into comics around roughly the same time. 
Um, and I was like, man, I was like, I want to, I want to do something where like, I can like, you know, talk about what I think about comics, like review comics and like, you know, stuff like that. And at the time I was aware of people like, uh, comics explain comic story. And I watched them, but I, as I'm one of those types of people, I don't really like paying too much attention to what other people do. Right. So like I watched them, but I didn't absorb them. <laughs> Mm. I, got <laughs> I was trying to be like my own person and right. uh mm-hmm. i was like dude i want to do something like that but i want to have my own flavor right. too your own little twist no nah, mm-hmm. yeah yeah mm-hmm. yeah like you know, it's it's a it's it's an old nazism you know it ain't nothing uh original no more no yeah. ideas original yeah oh no yeah, <laughs> that's, that's that. art man yeah like everybody did something before no you know right, what I mean? right, right, oh, yeah. right oh yeah hey, 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 it's 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 how you do it's it's how you yep. uh you you put your own spin on it yep. um but that was how i wound up getting uh ultimately uh into this so i would like to give a shout out to my old band Versera for kicking my ass out of the band because otherwise I probably never would have done this. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, gotta let that applause rock. Still Thank you to them. Them. Thank you to them. Oh yeah. Without them, we wouldn't we wouldn't even have you here without them. So right. we're thanking you as well. <laughs> yeah. Honestly, that is a beautiful story. <laughs> no, nah, it is. It is. <laughs> you know, especially because you just kept trying to figure out your thing. Like every time you mm-hmm. didn't give up on it, and that you know, a lot of people. Hey, a lot of people don't make it to where you know you mm-hmm. are because they give up at some point. So right. I, I think that's like, a beautiful thing. Yeah, man. Yeah. I, I, they quote another Jay Z has said, "Man, the people, the difference between you know the winners and the losers is the winners kept going." Oh, you know what yeah. I mean? So what's going on, man? Hey, hey. Yeah. Well, the quotables hey. today. <laughs> Jesus, <laughs> yes. Yes. I like hey, it. Man. Yeah, it's a spicy episode. <laughs> <Yes>. <laughs> No, nah, but that was amazing, man. Yeah. Um, but yeah, all right, all right, all right. We have two more questions for you. The next one is, so since with all of your knowledge on comic books, uh, how do you feel on the difference between the comic book movies and the comics yeah. on either end, like DC or Marvel or both either or? Um, you know, man, I'll be brutally honest. Um, Give it up. I feel Give the same up. way about comics I do about uh TV shows, movies, video games, uh, you know, any piece of media I've already consumed, man, do something different. Uh, mm. I mean, to a point, like you can, you can adapt a character or a story, but I don't need to be like 100% exactly the same. Right. Uh, you, know, you can switch it up a little bit. You can, you know, at least, Add some salt and pepper to it, or something. Don't mm-hmm. don't just put it. Don't just copy the recipe word for word. You know, you know maybe throw some paprika in there, or something. Right, right, right. right. Um, <laughs> <laughs> but uh, but no, I, uh, I I always like to use the movie uh, Sin City as an example. Uh, I you know, I read the comic back uh, you know before the movie came out and. I like the comics a lot. I like the stories. They didn't age well, but, uh, you know, they were cool comics. But when the movie came out, which I was so excited, I was like, oh, man, it's going to be so amazing. It's going to be the first comic book movie that's going to be, like, exactly like the comic. Mm. And then I watched it, and I have hated that movie more and more every time I've seen it since. The oh first time. no! <laughs> like I, you know, I want to be clear. I loved it the first time I saw it. Right, mm-hmm. right. But if I tried to watch it today, mm, true, I wouldn't make it through it. Never thought about I would that. get bored because mm-hmm. like, because I've seen it before. I've seen it. Like you know, give me, give me something else. Yeah. You know, like yeah. but but don't. Don't just throw any old thing out there. Uh huh. <laughs> uh huh. Like, you know, because because I could also say the same thing about, you know, uh, you know the, the Dark Phoenix. Yeah, you know, we've had two adaptations mm. of the Dark Phoenix. Yeah. And they have gotten worse. Oh, my <laughs> God. <laughs> all right. Man. <laughs> so, so, yeah. Don't, I know I said I wanted different. But I don't mean that different. <laughs> <laughs> I don't mean You stupid. need some balance. I hear right, you. Right. Uh-huh. Yeah. You got to meet me. You got to like, okay, case in point. I like to use a uh, moon Knight as an example. Mm. Moon Knight is not a hundred percent comics accurate as a TV show, right? but they adapted the stuff that I cared about and the things that they switched up. I didn't care enough about that. It made me 
angry. Like it was just like, oh, okay, that's different. Not the way I would have gone, but you know, I'll roll with it. Mm. You know, uh, you know, Stephen Grant is not a bumbling idiot or a, a, a mousy buffoon as a personality, but for the show, it worked. Right. You know, um, it just you know. Yeah, cool. I'll go with that. All right. <laughs> so, yeah. That's the yeah, that's the best take it there is. No, for sure. Yeah. For sure. It's honestly back to what we were saying before with the art thing. Like everything mm-hmm. is a, just everyone makes their own version of something else. You yeah. know what I mean? No, so, that's right. right. That's right. I know a lot of people that are big into comic books have their thoughts on the MCU and, right. and the DC stuff just because it's like sometimes they'll call it one line like Civil War, but Civil War was not really like Civil War in the comics and right. how they change things. Right. And things of that nature. So, mm-hmm. But that movie still, look at that movie. Right. right. It still so, works. Yeah. Because yeah. you know what it is? It's the core, like, principle of the story. Right. Yes. Is still there. Right. Mm-hmm. Like, yeah, there's no secret identities. So that part, you can't even do anything with that because mm-hmm. there, there are no secret identities really in the MCU. Like, very few characters have secret identities that matter. Like Spider Man's like the one dude. Yeah, right. That's right. (laughs) Right. Uh Spider Man's like the one character who has a secret identity. So it's like, okay, sure. Mm -hmm. Go get him, Tiger. (laughs) Uh, You know, but like if you you take a look at something like um, uh, uh, Age of Ultron, Mm -hmm. which is Age of Ultron in name only. Mm. And it's like like they take these things because, like, oh, this looks cool. Wow, that sounds cool. Like, like, ooh, Avengers, Age of Ultron. That sounds sexy. Oh, uh, <laughs> you know, it, it would be no different if, like, you know, the first X Men movie that came out was called X Men Manifest Destiny. It's like I don't expect this to adapt Manifest Destiny. I or if they said X Men Onslaught, I'd be like, Onslaught's in this movie, but there's no way they're adapting that whole dumb storyline. Right. Um, and I don't want them to either. I don't. <laughs> <laughs> Please don't adapt Onslaught. That's, 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 <laughs> Throwing leave, that out there as well. <laughs> right. Yeah, leave, leave Onslaught. Actually, leave both Onslaught and the Dark Phoenix. Just leave it over there. Where they belong. <laughs> oh, man. Yeah. I, I, dude, Chris Claremont agrees. I've talked to Chris Claremont before. He said himself, stop. Just don't, don't adapt. Wow. <laughs> he said just stop. Don't I feel him, though. Like, I've stop. seen it enough. Enough. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's true. <laughs> He's like, you killed it. Right. <laughs> like, yeah, like y'all. Remember Rocky, like Rocky Four, you know, like you, you like we're we're uh, where Apollo Creed's getting the crap kicked out of him by Ivan Drago, and the coach is off to the side. And he's like, throw the damn towel <laughs> with yes. the Dark Phoenix. I'm like, just stop. Just oh just, my goodness, just stop, please. Well, now it can happen. Stop. That's it. We've heard, we've heard Don't enough. Do it right. <laughs> <laughs> and, and I'll probably love it on the third time around. Right. Like, but still, I, right? It's like don't it's in the right it. hands now. But like, did they sully the name too? You know what uh, I mean? Give it they some time or something. Right, Let right, us get right. a little older. Right. You know, they make their phase like, eight, no, phase no, nine, like, something. Yeah. I mean, it, over there. I'll be sixty. I'll be sixty. <laughs> there you go. Wait, wait right. till I'm sixty. Right. You, right. you got twenty years. You got twenty there years to, right. to figure that out. So, for our final question for you, so. We're talking about we were talking about Marvel, we're talking about the comic book adaptations. Right. What is what is one Marvel and one DC comic book story run that you love that you would like to see a- adapted in live action that we haven't seen before? Oh, right. Um, you know, man, because they've actually kind of been, ooh, man, they've actually kind of been doing some of them lately. Oh, um, man. but uh, there's always more. Uh, there's always more that could be done. Of course. Um, you know. <sighs> If you would have asked me a year ago, I would have said Secret Wars, but it seems like we're getting that. <laughs> that might be the so, case. So, <laughs> I, I will say, you know what? Um, and this will probably never happen, so I guess it's safe to say it. Um, I would like to see the, uh, oh man, they would screw this up so badly. The Intergalactic <laughs> Empire of Wakanda. Uh, story arc. I would love to see somebody try to wow. make that movie. It would not work, but I would love to be proven wrong. Um, because it's it's 
it's just a lot going on in, in just a lot of comics. So I don't know. Maybe somebody could. Maybe uh, maybe uh, maybe someone can figure out a way to make it work. But um, I mean, that would have to be I, I Ryan, know. right? That would have to be Ryan Coogler, yeah, right? Have, but maybe, it's like maybe we write a letter. Maybe we, write, maybe we write a letter. You know what I mean? Maybe we can get something <laughs> together. I don't know. Like, hey, man, look, 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 look I, here's what you do. Here's what you do. Here's right, you do. right. So, look, I know we gotta wait a while for you know, old boy to age up. It's it's okay. Yes. It's okay. Um, we're not we're not worried about it. We'll just we'll just stick with Letitia Wright for right now. How about you know that? Gonna, we'll, we'll wait. We'll wait. But yeah, you know, when we do this, okay. So here's what you do. You 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 you, you send her out into space. You let her get caught. She's a slave, and you bring here. You do. You bring back Michael B. Jordan okay. as, as a Killmonger, but it's not the same Killmonger. You could say it's a variant. I don't care. What it, whatever the buzzword is right now. The <laughs> right there, you go. Uh, and then, bam! You just have you. You pay off the story arc from from Wakanda Forever. You 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 you, you have that confrontation and. I'm not saying I got to see a symbiote suit on Michael B. Jordan, but if I did, I wouldn't be upset about it. Mm. Uh, but the thing I care about, the only scene I would, the only reason I even suggest is because I think it would make a really cool moment for yes. you know, black superheroes is the final battle is on the soil of Wakanda prime. And you know, you, you just like we had, was it an in game with uh Falcon with the, you know, on your left, you know, and then the, you know, it's like, Oh my God, all these portals open up and all these like people go, I just want this moment just so we can have like, like a bunch of just random black superheroes. Oh my <laughs> God. This is incredible. <laughs> That'd be tough. Oh, I need it. Every black variant <laughs> yeah. they have. Right. Just, you right. Might just, I, I, I at a certain point, you're going to start to stretch, but it's cool. Like, we're just going to yes. throw people in there. Next like, thing you know, Dave Chappelle's <laughs> there. We don't even know why. We need this all. <laughs> like, no William show up. It's like, yo, series. Whoa. No Disney Plus series, no cameos or post credit whatever's in any movies. We'll just see characters that have never been in the MCU before. <laughs> before. Like just okay, sure. People and, and instead of saying where where it's uh, uh, where it was Cap, he says Avengers. <laughs> no, no, you, you just have you just you just have you you Black Panther be like what kind of. Forever. And then yep. bam, everybody Ooh. just break out fight. Dude, oh my god. I'm, tell you right I'm seeing now, this now. This you got me visualizing this, man. <laughs> Don't, we got we might gotta Marvel? stop. Tyler Perry might just start talking to <laughs> Yo, you better We're relax. Sure. You better relax. And he's not the one to do it, you know? We gotta <laughs> hey, I'm just Kevin Fye, he call me. Yes, hey, there hey, man. We keep trying to talk to him every episode. He hasn't got our calls. Maybe he'll help us. <laughs> Kevin. <laughs> Kevin. Well, just, right. He might be a little busy right now. Right. You know what I mean? Um, <laughs> she's like, man, look, I'm busy. Man. I'm trying to handle this, this, this foolishness going on. Right, here. right. Uh, nope. DC's a trickier one because, you know, I, I don't know what to do with DC. I don't, I, I don't know. I felt that sigh. I knew what that was. <laughs> Dude, I man, it, 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 man, look, it, it's, <laughs> you know what? I would just be like, man, just make a good movie. I wouldn't even tell them to oh, adapt. They're like, look, man, don't try to adapt nothing. Just <laughs> make a good movie. I don't, I don't care. I, I tell you what, I tell you what you do. I tell you, here's what you do. Here's what you do. It's so uh, sad. You DC. just gotta ask for that. <laughs> from I'm a, like dying. From a I'm studio like, that makes movies. Yo, that's like, crazy. It's like, <laughs> I'm just like, he just wants the bear. Man. Just make Look, something just, good. That we, it, let's start by the way, first. let's start. Can we first. enjoy it? <laughs> that's right. all. Like, you know, right? Like, I'm not. You know what? I take that back. Not even a good movie. I just want something that. <laughs> I can watch. Like, just okay. Like, I just, just want to be able to sit down for two hours and <laughs> be like, yo. And not want to go to sleep. Right. Like, I don't want to go nowhere else, you know? Look, I just, I want to be able to remember the movie, like, after, um, like, after I, I wake up in the theater. I want to be able to remember the movie. That's right. Like, yes. <laughs> That's serious. Though. For real. It, I get it. it. It's, it's sad. It is it's unfortunate. Sad. Oh, but you know, I do have a, uh, you know what? Oh, come on. I'll tell you what you do. Start using milestone stuff. Yes. Mm. Yes. When they were talking all that mess about a a black Superman movie, and they're like, yeah, we're going to make a black Superman movie. And and, no, 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 no. We're not making Sunshine Superman. We're not making Val Zod or or, or President Superman. No, we're just going to make Clark Kent black. That's what we're doing. I was like, yo, do this. Y'all got a black Superman. 
His name's Icon. Make that movie. How about that? Make a static movie. Make a yes. make a make a hardware movie. Something uh, Blood Syndicate. I don't know. Just <laughs> oh, look. Just 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 let let them let. Yeah. We I feel, we you. feel you. Pain, we man. feel you. We go. I'm about to get upset. <laughs> Jesus, it's too. You're just asking for something we would like. Right? Yeah. <laughs> just, I'm not. I'm not even. It's like, man. I don't, I, man. <laughs> you know. You know what it is. It's. It's like you know. Like man, I was trying to give you one last chance, and y'all just. No, I did feel like that. I hear you. Yeah. It's unfortunate though. Like it's just because we yeah. knew we knew this was probably gonna be like one of the final Johns. You know what I mean? Like mm-hmm. Gun is right there. He's like, oh, we're about to redo everything. Da 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 da. But it's yeah. like, bro, this <laughs> y'all 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 stop that girl from coming out. Why? Why would you... that? Someone made a great point about that. I don't want to get into a whole mm. new thing, but they were yeah. just like, hey, by the way, I think Bad Girl would have made more than Shazam. And I was like, oh snap! <laughs> I just Whoa, thought man. about. it. I was like, maybe that's true. We never saw it. Yeah. We don't know, but it's like, wow. It could have. Wow. Let me tell you something. Let me tell you something. If Bad Girl would have came out, mm-hmm. I don't care how bad it would have been. Come on, come on. Black folks would have went to go see it. Come on. Latinos would have went to go see it. <laughs> you ain't never lie. Wonder why? That's a whole. I think if I'm not, I, 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 I might be misremembered. That's a whole Afro Latino woman. Yes, it is. That's a great show. Yes, it is. Somebody was go go see that. Are you talking <laughs> right now? Yes. You need to see Catwoman. Remember right. what it was? Just oh on God. the strength. On the strength of Holly Berry. Come on. That was it. It was a horrible movie, but we was there. And we, we, we all came out. <laughs> y- y'all ain't never lied. Right. Oh my goodness. Look, look, we went to go see Catwoman on the strength. Then we were going to see Halle Berry in a skimpy suit. That, that, <laughs> That's it, all of the it people, wasn't for yeah. the plot. Nobody went to go see that movie for the plot. You alive? You say you did. <laughs> um, but you know, with Batgirl, it's like you know what? And y'all gonna have Michael Keaton in this? Come on, y'all. It, it sounds like you know, y- y- y'all had you know, some competent directors that you know. Yeah, Brendan Fraser. Right. Look at the whole. Yeah. He just won yeah. for the whale. Like a perfect. Right. That would have been a good. Job. What is going on, right? Bro. That would have been a good layup. Again? He was a. Uh, he was a uh, Firefly. I think yes. was the villain. Yep. Yeah, oh, he was Firefly. Yeah. Yep. Like what's yep. going and on? And yeah. then they just said, "Shit, yep. <laughs> get that out of here." Wow. Paid right off on the taxes and kept it moving. <laughs> they did. That's, what that's they literally they did. what it is. I know. I just they, they, that they that's told why. me that I didn't make that up. <laughs> like, hey, hey, David Zaslav is the real dark side. Yeah. Y'all just, y'all oh, just, y'all that's, just right. that's right. That, that in this, got them Omega in, memes. <laughs> right. I was just about to say, like in this episode now, now you got to bring up Zaslav's face in this, in this dark side. <laughs> yeah, yeah, dark side. Like beam just shooting every which direction. Right, like, right. Yeah, I'm telling you, it's, but, but no, I yeah that yeah that bat girl would have. It wouldn't have made like hundreds of like 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 it wouldn't have made a billion dollars, right? Right. But it made a, it would have made his budget. Yeah. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. Which yeah. is better than Shazam can say, I think, by this point. Gosh. And it wasn't that bad. <laughs> It wasn't yeah, that bad. I like Shazam. <laughs> right, like, yeah. I like Shazam. It's just things that's going on. Right. Man. Yeah, just. It, yeah. But it was it was a movie that was difficult for me to sit through just because I was like, none of this matters. None of this matters. It doesn't, yeah, it's, right? It's, it's leads to nothing. <laughs> right. <laughs> and, nothing. and I'm like, hey, y'all still got Flash? Y'all still got Flash you out still here? still got the Flash. Oh man! Yeah. All right, I'm yeah. so confused because it's Aquaman included in this whole conversation, <sighs> bro. Anyway, we could we deal with it all. Day. We could do this all day, right? Let's, let's yeah. get back to let's get back to switch gears real quick. Let's get we back to Marvel. Oh look, yes. I can do this all day. Yeah. You, you ain't see what I did? Come on, we need a we need a, a tag for bars or something. Right here, yeah, we do. Yes, we do. Yes, we do. <laughs> all right, but yeah, you wanna uh, you wanna start with this yeah, one? Yeah, this yeah, the, uh, sure. I can't see which one we do. This one, Victoria Alonso. All right. right. So, Ooh. yes, Victoria Alonso, who was, I want to get uh, what her position was 100% correct. She was the president of production, VFX, and animation yep. at Marvel Studios. And she was let go recently, uh, well, fired. And uh, it was big news because she's been there for a very long time, right? I think she, it was 17 years, I think. Yeah, I think it was like Iron Man. She's that been there be since wrong. Iron Man. Iron yes. Man, right? Yes. Yeah, so... Yes. Mm-hmm. That, that, she actually that, co-founded a, Marvel Studios with right. Kevin Feige. There we go. Yeah. So this is uh, the number two. Just got. She was in the trenches. Got, yeah. yeah. Mm-hmm. 
So, react. Just kidding. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Do you want to add? Do you want to add the uh, yeah, yeah. other person so, first, so then we get more? Well, yeah. It? Also, you know, Marvel, Disney, they they it's Disney. They yeah. clean the house right now. Yes. So, oh yes. Also, we had Ike Perlmutter, another um, Marvel Entertainment um, guy. He was let go as well. He was laid off, and that was after her. her right? That was after her. Yeah, that yeah. was after her. Um, he has like a history um, of doing some interesting, not interesting, but like some shady stuff. There we go. And uh, he tried to get Kevin Feige fired. Yeah. So there's a lot of tea going around. It's a sure. lot. It is a lot. So uh, he was also the guy who said no one would go see a female-led superhero movie. Wow. He is also the guy who said, well, this is great. No one would notice if Black Panther was white. Oh, wow. Oh, this is amazing news. Wait, we should be applauding. <laughs> I heard this about part. the first side, but the second part, I, oh, that's crazy. He had a pocket right. for that one. Because now it, the oh, Victoria's yeah. situation is a whole different thing. Yeah. This is oh, amazing yeah. right yeah. now. Yeah. Oh, wow. Wow. Uh, Ike Perlmutter is mm, a known Trump supporter. Yeah, I oh. seen that picture. They, they one of them oh, trades put a that lot out there. Of things going on. Huh? He, he, yeah. He's on the diamond level. He's on the diamond level. <laughs> oh for, uh, no! Donations. He's on he the sits over level. there. He sits at the yeah. top. <laughs> oh okay. He, he's got the skybox. Got he's it. I didn't box. know it was like that. Man, yeah, my he's uh, he's, he's, uh, he's he's a known sexist racist. Oh wow! I'm not even putting a legend behind any of this. It just is what it that is. Is what he but, is. Um, right. He, yeah, he was the guy who basically said that on top of no one would notice a Black Panther was uh, cast as a white person. Uh, he That's also didn't think awesome. anyone would go see it. He didn't think anyone would go see the movie. Um, and, and he was, and he almost, almost on top of trying to get Kevin Feige fired, he almost ran Kevin Feige off to D.C. Yeah, yeah. Oh, my yeah. goodness. Yeah. He really wait, so he thought about leaving. Yeah, yeah. No, he legitimately was going to leave. Yeah, he was oh, legit going wow. to leave. Oh, so, we yeah. just because he, he had the close. he had the answer to him right. It was like it was like a go through him to get to yep. wow. Iger type things, and then mm-hmm. Iger winded up like just kind of cutting the middleman right? out and just yo, we just going me and you, me and you know with Feige, oh, wow. you know. This is like, like power. Mm-hmm. Yeah, it Did is. Did Fifty Cent write this storyline? <laughs> Oh my goodness! Right. I would love this to see that. This is crazy. <laughs> Wait, love to see what? Yeah, uh, power, yeah, yep. Power book, book six, Feige. Oh, this is immaculate, Kevin. We <laughs> will star. I don't care. We'll do some things. Everybody, come on. Oh, but no. Wow. Okay. I don't even know if there's much to, to say besides like we should be dancing. Peace out, bro. I'm, I'm, yeah. yeah. Bye. <laughs> Dude, I hit him with man, boy, bye. Bye. <laughs> this is a joyous day. Well, that's cool. So that's a little different. Like, we'll go to the Victoria. Um, right. Alonzo. Yeah. So Victoria Alonso. Hers is weird. It was. Hers is weird. It was. It was. Um, it was because a f- no one knows why. Exactly. Right. It's been like things go. like, it felt like Marvel will put out one thing like, oh, she was working on Argentina, you the, the Amazon yes. movie. Yes. And then they jump back mm-hmm. out and it's like, like no, they, thing. nah, no, that's not why. That's I not mean. what happened. You know, <laughs> stop it. Yeah. And then it's like, they'll jump back out and say something and then. Yeah, what's going on? Yeah, I don't, I don't, I don't like well, it. <laughs> like supposedly it was over like some LGBTQIA plus uh, yeah. representation in, or or rather the removal of it. removed mm-hmm. from their overseas versions of films because like you know heard this uh, right. they wanted it to play in Kuwait I think it was yep. mm-hmm. and yeah they 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 you know and she refused to take that out and they went and got somebody else to do it. This is mm-hmm. yeah. So now so. Because I heard that they're talking to her for the settlement. So I don't even know. Is that true? I didn't hear that, but I'm not surprised. If so, that seemed like yeah. what's something they would do. They don't want to take that and drag that out of oh, court. So this is bad. Yeah. So they're doing it, it's, good things and weird things. She probably got a severance yeah. anyway, though. Oh, no. She's good. Yeah. She's good. She ain't oh, hurting. Man. I don't, I don't be, think she's hurting. Yeah. She's, That's in she's contract. been with Marvel since 2008. Right. She, she's she got the golden parachute. Uh, yeah. she, She's good. Um. If anything, the only thing I could probably say be bad for her on on her side of things, her reputation uh, took a hit. Yeah, right before all this happened, um, because there, were, there was all the VFX, uh-huh. uh, the the allegations of uh, her bullying visual effects artist and uh, getting people, you know, quotey fingers, uh, blackballed from. Um, uh-huh. Uh, future 
Marvel VFX jobs and presumably VFX jobs for other studios. But uh, none of that has been founded on anything. It's been right. That's just it's a lot of people. Right. Alleged, right? Yeah, yeah. It's, it's a lot of people speaking under anonymity. Right. And whenever you have that going on, it's like you never. I really can't know. really yep, yep, invest can't into, into that. that. <laughs> like on either side, it's like what is yeah. happening? That's noted, but I can't right. use that. Yeah. You know what I mean? Like I can't use right. that. But it is what it is. <laughs> well, hopefully. <laughs> I don't even know if I want to say hopefully news comes out about that because that just sounds like some stuff. Yeah. Um, well, oh, oh, we'll find out later. And it's going to be, it's going to be some mess. Yeah. yeah, yeah I'm sure. <laughs> I'm sure. But I wanted to ask the question. We seeing them do all these moves. We know it's like a lot of pick. I know Disney got rid of a lot of people. Yeah. Recently. Mm-hmm. Um, these are just things that are happening within this time. But do we think that, is this like a big? We know Iger came in after Chapex yep. dismissal, right? Mm-hmm. Is this like a big? Uh, do y'all think this is a big uh, shakeup from Iger? Like, yo, we need to get things back on track as far as like financial uh, things that are hindering the process of getting these. Because she ran the VFX production side, right, that's and that's been thing. people been having their like mm-hmm. he said the the VFX houses yeah. are. are Having issues, you got fans saying things. You know what I mean? Oh, like, making a good point. The VFX and this is not yeah. good. You know, like I wonder, is this some type of? Is this like a sign reaction of them to that? reacting right. to certain things and get trying to get things back on track? You know, I can tell you this much: um, they've been working towards building their own in-house VFX studio. Mm. So, kind of yeah, and kind of no. Gotcha, right. but. Uh, at the same time, I think it's just honestly it's a perfect storm of of, Dang, dings, yeah. of, of, of stuff happening all at once. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> like it's a perfect a storm, of like everything just kind of popping off mm-hmm. all at once. I, I, but truth be told, I know they made profits because the shareholders, I believe, said they only expected to make like twenty three billion, and they made like twenty four. Like I think it was like twenty four point something. Other. They, they ain't hurting. They ain't hurting at all. Of course not. Oh yeah, no, we talking about Disney. <laughs> yeah, right. They, and that never. <laughs> yeah. Never. But basically, I think the thing that has people scared because I've talked to some people about this too is that they're worried not about Marvel Studios. They're worried about Marvel Comics. Right, um, right, right, right. Because supposedly they don't think Marvel Comics amounts to that much money. <laughs> yeah, I see <laughs> that. Yeah, which has people thinking like, "Oh man, are are they are they gonna uh, man are they gonna shut down Marvel Comics? Right. Uh, they're not gonna shut down Marvel Comics. Right. You might see less comics, mm. but they're not gonna shut it down. Right. I was about to say that's scary. I mean, it is. Like, yeah. Okay. No, 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 right. And like they'll, they'll do like DC did. DC doesn't put out that many comics either. Mm-hmm. Uh, they cut. There was one point in time DC was dropping like 20, 30 books a month. Now they drop maybe or not. I won't say a month, but they, there was a time where it was like ten or twelve a week. That's wow. crazy. That is now crazy. it's close to like mm, you get six one week. You might get eight the next. Gotcha. Right. So. Okay. Well, uh, quality over quantity, and honestly, I don't think would be a bad idea on Marvel's part. Oh, oh just about to course. say for the movie, of course, because they already yeah. were. Yeah, we're pushing everything back. The shows getting we're not dropping that many shows, and yeah. we're gonna push that back. We're gonna yeah. drop the, mm-hmm. the movies getting pushed back. So, I mean, I'm hoping. Everything pans out yeah. in a positive way. Yeah. You know what I mean? Oh, yeah. yeah. I, I think it will. Yeah. I think it will. I think, like, tr- truth be told, and I think this is, man, it's going to sound awful. We have an embarrassment of riches. We do. That's true. <laughs> and sometimes it's okay to admit we got too much stuff to watch. And that's why like, I always tell people, like, I'm like, if you're terminally dialed into the MCU, God help you. Um, <laughs> speaking as a person who is, it's not healthy. It is not <laughs> healthy. Um, and sometimes, oh, man, no. I do myself a favor. Sometimes, I'm like, you know what? I'm going to watch something else. Yeah. I'll watch some. I want to watch some. It got nothing to do with a cape. Oh, yeah. I don't want to see not one cape. I don't want to see. Uh, I don't want to see lasers come out of anybody's hands. I just want to watch something regular, like we're just regular. Like I, I started watching Yellowstone. I was like, this is the most different. I heard thing that's a good anything. one. I did I hear that. Was that's good. very good. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, Yellowstone's fantastic. Okay, uh, I got to get into it. Yeah. White people 
people being messy and terrible to each other. Oh my god! Oh my that god! Like Do you also too. watch Succession? Yeah, yeah, yeah that sounds like Succession. There's shout a lot out, of great shout out to Adam if he's watching. If oh he watches god. this, yeah, 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 Succession yes, Adam. <laughs> also, uh, House of Dragon. We can keep going. Yeah, there's some, no, there's right, right. Yeah, right. You know. Yeah. <laughs> Wait, since we're on it, uh, Yellowstone is that on Showtime? What is that on Amazon? It's on uh, Peacock. Peacock. Okay. Gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. Peacock's Peacock kind of uh, killing it right now. Okay. They got some stuff. Local. They got some stuff. Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And they got right, spinoffs. Cool. They got oh, wow. spinoffs. Uh, Paramount Plus has the 1883 spinoffs, like a that's right. they are it's like connected. a take on the Oregon Trail, and that's the one with Harrison Ford, right? The Wait, one, that's connected well, that's to that. Sa- it's a uh, Sam Elliott and Tim McGraw, uh, but 1923. 1923 is the one with Harrison, Harrison Ford, Ford Helen and uh, Helen Mirren. Yeah, got you. Okay, I didn't. I didn't they know they was all connected uh, like that at all. I'm like, what is yeah, going yeah, on? So oh, no. they have another one coming out called uh, I think it's called 1883 uh, Bass Reeves, uh, and it's supposed to have David Oyelowo as uh, oh, I Bass love him. Reeves, the original, the 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 real Lone Ranger. Remember oh, Bass Reeves? Oh, they were talking about mm-hmm. him on Watchmen. Oh yep. wow! Yeah. You ain't never lied. He was the first. Oh, that's gonna be crazy. US Marshal. That's and this is like, Peacock again. Yeah. Uh, okay. uh, it'll either be on Peacock or it'll be on Paramount Plus. I noticed that like the main Yellowstone show comes on on Peacock. All the spinoffs come out on Paramount so Plus. Interesting. Okay. I don't understand why they do yeah. it that way, but it just it is what it is. Okay. But, I'm um, about to. You just sign me yeah. up. Look at you. Did. Oh yeah. But, uh, <laughs> I got when I go home. Oh no, because yes. I—they said Bass Reeves. Because I—I'll tell anybody to this day, Lone Ranger was not a white man. Talk that was him. a whole brother. Yeah. Yes. <laughs> that, look, yeah, and, and and Tonto, look, yeah, yeah, Tonto wasn't hanging out with no white man. <laughs> <laughs> he said, "No, that don't make sense." No, it's like that don't make sense. It just don't. It's like I kept watching. I was looking at it. Like, Hold up. I didn't like. I don't know what's wrong. Like, something, nah. something don't sit right nah. with this, man. <laughs> <laughs> This is amazing. Okay. <laughs> Back to Marvel. Yeah. Awesome. So we got the Captain America 4 yeah, you got this updates. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm excited yeah. about this. Yeah. So, you know, as we know, they're shooting Captain America 4 right now. Uh, Captain America mm-hmm. 4. Uh, Captain America New World Order. My bad. There we go. Yeah. I mean, um, both. Same both thing. Same thing. Yeah, you know, yeah, same. You know we call it. Everybody's going to be like, no, nah, that's Captain that's America. That's Captain 4, man. Yeah, that's Captain 4. Cap but um, yeah, so they're shooting that currently right now. Um, we did just learn that Liv Tyler is returning as Betsy Ross. Um, mm-hmm. well, this is the first time in it. Hold up, is the does that Incredible Hulk movie count as MCU? Right, it does. Not. It does. Well, right? it, it did. It did. Right. Okay. Okay. So yeah, she's yeah. she's coming she back home. That's all. She coming yeah, back yeah, home. Yeah, yeah. But, but uh, either way, it's not like they treat it that way. So it's kind of big. Going I mean, they kind of right? pick and choose the things right. they like to exactly. keep. Exactly. Yeah. They they take things from it. Right. Like Thunderbolt Ross is right. it's from from yeah. it. is from that. <laughs> so interesting, yeah. But but like and, and apparently and the leader because uh, you're Tim Blake Nelson. Yeah, Tim, yeah. Uh, he Tim was Blake on set Nelson. as well. Yeah. Yes, he was. Uh, uh, he was supposed to be. Uh, they were setting him up for the leader in 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 uh, Incredible Hulk, and then they you know obviously yeah, yeah. we didn't get that <laughs> right <laughs> right yet, not yet. now yeah. Uh-huh. <laughs> Did you speaking of this is a part of that? Did you see the pictures of him on set because he actually had like the green, green arm, green like arms. from the end of the mm-hmm. yeah, 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 which so, is just crazy. I'm just like, bro. <laughs> I'm assuming you they probably gonna, gonna recreate that that scene right, little, from- little. <laughs> <laughs> I'm like, bro, leader. <laughs> All right. All right. right, like I want to know. Yeah, how do you feel? About no, no, no. Yeah, 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 yeah. Let's get into it. Yeah, okay. Yeah, yeah. How do you feel that there's all these Hulk people in this Captain America movie? Do you like it? Are you like this right? Because we got Harrison Ford. There's three of them. Red Hulk. Yeah. Who's the third. Yeah. It's and, the leader, and Red Hulk, and his daughter. Right. 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 Yeah. yeah. And she could be and Red She Hulk. You for all we know. We have true, no idea. True. Don't be surprised. Don't be surprised if you see more of that because mm. the the way it has been. Since uh, uh, since the Incredible Hulk, is that they don't have the rights right. to make solo films about the Hulk anymore. That's why we don't see him anymore. Um, I think those are still with Paramount, but the rumor is they're supposed to be getting those rights back. Oh, back. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm-hmm. And so maybe we will. They they kind of hint at it in She Hulk. A little like, bit, right? yeah. Like, uh-huh. Hulk, they yeah. do like a little, like it's like a little quick, like ha ha, threw this out here. Can't, all right, move along. Yeah, uh-huh. uh, but I don't know if or when that'll happen. I'm okay with the Hulk villains being in a Captain America story. 
if it's told well, because I kind of feel like this is like a soft uh, Thunderbolts uh, mm-hmm. setup. This feeling, yeah, uh, with all this feeling. going on here with Thunder, because it they've made it pretty obvious. Uh, old, old Fatty Kins is is actually going to turn into Red Hulk in this movie, right? <laughs> so. They like said it, didn't they? Almost announce it. They were like, Thunder. "Or am I making that up?" They were like, uh, no, um, "Yeah, they were like Harrison Ford is playing." Um, Thunderbolt, Thunderbolt Ross, Ross as Red Hulk. Like yeah. I've seen it. Yeah. As I'm like, yeah, yeah, yeah. well, thanks yeah, for letting us know. Can he be President Red Hulk? <laughs> I think he is. I think he will be. I think that's what's going. He's going to be president. So. Yeah. yeah. What is happening I mean, in this I'm film? I'm excited. Yeah. I, I just want to see the mustache. Yeah. I just want to see. If, I just want to see Harrison Ford with the mustache. That's yeah. it. We, we talk about that. Because <laughs> if he doesn't get the mustache, all right, we're, we're, we're yeah, it doesn't count. Yeah. He's just Harrison. He's just Harrison Ford, and that's all it is. Otherwise. Right. <laughs> I'm like, man, look, get Indiana Jones up out of here, man. Look, go you ahead. Know? Right. I'm so excited down, to man. see how this all right. So how do how do how do you feel with the Hulk people in it? I like it. Um I'm gonna tell you something I told you told you off off pod. Uh we take a step back and think about this in retrospect. I don't know if we're gonna get a now this is just speculation, right? I don't know if we're gonna get a a trilogy from Sam Wilson's Cap America. Hopefully we do. But oh, hot take. You don't think no, 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 no. Let me finish. Yeah, yeah. Let me. Get hey, it now. I'm not all the way done. <laughs> I'm just saying we don't know. Especially Black what I, Twitter no, no, no. will hit you. <laughs> especially what Iger was saying. He was saying, "Yo, we don't know if we need." Oh, these you are making exactly. a very good point. But I'm also also to add to that, the last Captain America movie was Civil War. So like you're f- kind of following that up with this like like yeah it's a new thing it's but it is a Captain America movie. Mm, I hear. So you. like, do you think that's? I'm a saying they just beefing it up, it bro. They couldn't. We got. Harrison Ford, Liv Tyler. Oh, it's just you're, throwing things at it. It's like we're going to make this an event. I feel like just, they're just going to make this an event movie. Nah, you know you're what right. I mean? but, like, not, but now that you got me thinking, so if they, is is that why you think they wouldn't possibly? We're, we know, don't know. I, like we're being we're almost, hypothetical. No. It's a lot of people come. It's a lot of new characters coming into MCU that right, we even still right. haven't even seen yet mm-hmm. that we know are coming. So it's like not to like discount Cap. You know what I mean? Yeah, but I I'm just saying like not even about we don't know. Like let's see. You know, we probably see how it goes. You know what I mean? But I feel like on this first one. We going we gonna give you everything, you just, know what I mean? Especially just to start it off, just to start it like, off. Let's, bang. Let's, let's throw a Hulk it's in there. It's like an yeah. Avengers four point five, right? It, right. Want to call it? It's it's like Civil War <laughs> and Hulk, right? Right. With I like that. I like that. It is. It is. It's Civil Hulk. That sounds so. fun. It, it does. Like sound, fun it does sound fun. Movie. I'm excited. You don't right. got to tell me nothing. Yeah. It's Black yeah. Cat. We ready to go. Also, <laughs> with the Liv Tyler announcement, they also announced that Carl Lumbly. Who played uh, mm-hmm. Isaiah Bradley is also go. coming back. There we go. Yes, and this question for y'all: Do y'all think we're going to see more expounded on his history in the MCU and more with Patriot? Like, him becoming I got, a, who he's... I got a different hot take, but I don't want to go first because mine's sad. <laughs> 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 I think I might know where you're going with that. Should I go first since I did it, or y'all I mean, just y'all should go? Uh, I, I no? mean, I tell you what. I, I'll take the heat off of you. I'll take Go the ahead. heat Thank off you. of you. <laughs> I feel so much cool. I'm about to drink this water. <laughs> <laughs> so I think we will see. Like I think I think we'll get some flashbacks. Okay. I think we'll get some flashbacks. Um I don't actually no, I'll take the back. I do. I do think we'll get some Patriot. Actually, okay. I'd be shocked. Because, okay. I mean, it's like, it was kind of like the, it was like the most obvious thing in the world when yeah. uh, yes. the Falcon Winter Soldier show was on. was like, yeah, hey, you go see the, uh, oh, hey, it's Captain America. Hey, yeah, it's Black Captain America. Okay, cool. Hey, hey, cool. Let me, you know, meet you. Oh, yeah, they'll never let a black man be Captain America. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> like, things, I always thought it was kind of funny that, like, his, that, that Patriot answered the door and there was like, mm. oh yeah, it's Patriot. All right, get on out of here. Yeah, <laughs> it was kind of fly though. The way you know, what like, I mean? we're not ready for y'all yet. Right, not yet, not yet. Just hold on. But, but no, you no, see, no. but you see, yeah, but you see. You see. You they, they've been dragging out the Young Avengers <laughs> for like oh, the man. last two years. It's like, hey, guess what? Yeah, y'all watching WandaVision? <laughs> hey. Yep. Billy and Tommy. Yeah. Billy and Tommy. Like, right? yeah, hey, hey, you see Doctor Strange be doing things. You see it? You see it? Yeah. We got Kate Bishop. We got Cassie now. Yeah, look, look at this. Look, we got, look, we got, got, got Kate Bishop. Uh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Hey, hey, y'all watch Loki? Kid Loki was in it. Yeah. yeah. Kid Loki, you want it? Yeah. Hey, you know, hey, you know we got the X-Men coming, so you know. 
it's only a matter of time. Right? Exactly. Exactly. Yep. <laughs> it's like hey y'all remember them young avengers yeah it's like a, i feel like that's every time i watch um uh I, and then of course the end with the quantum mania it's like okay well kang's here so clearly iron lad is mm. somewhere. somewhere somewhere yeah <laughs> mm-hmm. like, like clearly clearly so yeah i i definitely think patriot will be present i don't know how present or how much Carl Lumbly is going to be doing. Right, I would right. love to see a lot of him, okay. but I'm I'm preparing myself for him to only be in it like a little bit. True. Yes. What's your sad take? It's pro- it's, oh, I think it I definitely know. goes with what you said. <laughs> um, oh, so hold on, hold on. Give it some preface because <laughs> yeah, the, 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 the leaked there pictures that came out, help it out is, yeah. is <clears throat> so the leaked behind the scenes pictures of this film that came out were. Of which, a funeral, which is also why they announced that uh, Liv Tyler was coming back. Yeah, because she was in the because pictures, she was so they were just like, right. just we gonna throw there it out go. there, just so y'all know. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. And then mm-hmm. those photos we seen Liv Tyler's Betty, Betty Ross character, and we also seen Anthony Mackie and his sister, and his sister's character. Yeah, I, I forget the actress's name. I apologize, but she was in when yeah, Falcon Winter Soldier. Yeah, there yep, we go. Yep, and they were. It was basically like a military funeral. It looked like. Right. So know. with that conversation, thank you for giving the, the backstory. Yeah. Okay. With that being said, everybody that is that saw that online was. Basically, you know, the discourse was like, ooh, who, who passed away? Who died? Who died? Um, and everyone was kind of like, for some reason, just immediately going to Harrison Ford. And I'm like, why in the world would they get Let Harrison me stop you real Ford? quick. Let me stop you real quick. Because with that, because you right on. <laughs> come on, come on. Give it up. Give it up. <clears throat> we do know now. I don't know if this everybody knows this. But I, I mean, if you paid attention to the trailers for Secret Invasion, you right. know something happens with the president in that show. Yeah. So I'm a, mm-hmm. my take was not to take away from what you about to go, go ahead. No, you about but my take was that they it's a president's funeral. Yep. You know what I mean? That would make you the most I like that. You know? I like that. I'll take it. That makes yeah. sense I'll to me. That. It does. For everybody to come out that like that. Because who does Bessie Ross know in MCU? That's outside what of I was saying. Hulk. And he's not here. So yeah. it's like, why would she mm-hmm. be there? Yeah. It's either that or her dad and I don't they not gonna kill they're not. Nah, they're not gonna do that it's to like, the hey, support. Support. you wanna come and play a dead dude? Right. <laughs> right, like what? Unless it's some, unless it's some real crazy plot twist where he faked his death. And there we go. But I, mean, I don't even think they're going that deep. It's, with it's that. too much with that. It's right. already go, too much going on in the movie. Like, <laughs> right. Oh my goodness. Nah, he was he was a scroll. He was scroll the whole time. There we go. He was. That's a whole yeah, other side that it could be. <laughs> True. Whole side. It was William Hurt. The William Hurt version was a scroll. That, that that's what it was. Oh, and they could, they, that's the really what they should have flipped it. That's right. What they right. Nah, but man, I was thinking <laughs> that the funeral was possibly, and I don't want to do this to him because I love seeing him. Is who do we just say? I'm sorry, Patriots. Carl Lombie's Isaiah Bradley, right? Um, and yeah. I was thinking based off of I don't know, just the story in Captain America could inspire Patriot, like you said, True. to become Patriot. True. So I yeah. just feel like that could now the only w- where plot hole of my theory is like why in the hell would Betsy be there? But True. But he it could a, be he's military. A, he's military. So yeah. I was like, you know, you never really know. But um. I do, yeah. I do think it makes more sense with you saying everything about Patriot. So that just yeah. kind of co- correlated, yeah, with, with yeah. everything that's going on. Yeah, but um, I don't know. I'm Somebody's just glad that I'm just, I'm just glad that in the MCU, Isaiah Bradley is not like what's the word I want to use. He's not um, he is not regressed. Oh, uh, he's not mentally regressed. That's I what I'll it. say. Mm-hmm. Uh-huh. <laughs> yeah, 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 right. I do I'm like still that. Sharp. I'm just glad, I do like that. I'm just glad for that. I was like, you know what? But see, that's how you. That's how you change stuff. Mm-hmm. You, you look at it, mm, I don't like this. Yeah, do something different. There you yeah, go. That, yeah. that, that that's different. Yeah, I'm no, like he, he he just beat up. He just beat up and broken down. He, right. he, he tired. Yeah, he's tired. Yeah, he, he, he's, 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 he's tired. He's tired. He's like, I just want to sit down. He's like I want to sit down and watch my stories. That's it. Yeah, that's yeah. It. <laughs> not even tired with an R. The tired. <laughs> you know, he tired. tired. The T Y D. There we go. T Y D. I don't know why they killed me. <laughs> T Y D Tide. I'm about to die. That's it. That's it. No, you ain't never lie. You ain't never lie. Um, but this next one, this is our last main topic today before we get into our fun, um, our movie versus game. Mm-hmm. But Daredevil. So there's been a couple little updates that's going on with Daredevil. But I know last episode, um, our updates were that John Berthnall was in, right? Yes. It was also the whole Karen and Foggy thing, right? Yes. So now there is more new and uh, Vanessa being recast. So yes. now there's a whole new news. Mm, Do you yeah. want to get into what the? It's like two, three things. It right? is a few things. So, um, 
the first one. It's yeah. the juicy one. Let's get into Okay. Yeah. Should I get into it like that or should I? Yeah, go ahead. Okay, okay. Yeah. All right. So it's been a, it's a lot of different rumors going around. We get we have some rumors and we also have like some some things from Vincent D'Onofrio who <laughs> plays Kingpin, who's yeah. been talking a lot. I'm only laughing because yeah, he just be saying stuff. I'm like, <laughs> Are you supposed to be saying this, sir? I love you, but don't get in trouble. Right. He's just like just saying so, a bunch of stuff. I'll start with him talking and then I'll segue into some of the rumors cool. that we've been hearing. But um he did an interview recently. Um while they, while they have been filming, and he's just talking about how different the tone is going to be. It's going to be a little different than a Netflix show. But he's saying that everything that the fans want, they're going to get. And mm-hmm. that he alluded to a season two of the show. He didn't even allude. He said the word season He two. did say the word season two. <laughs> like, he was like, hey. Mm-hmm. This. But mm-hmm. um, we do know that it's going to be 18 episodes. Um, yeah. So, I don't know. One thing I was thinking that that could be some type of split. Well... We actually got a tweet from one of these people. My time to shine said something about it that could just kind of clarify. Um, this we're only bringing, you know, we don't always want to go into rumor, rumor like leaks and stuff. But this kind of made sense with what was being said because none of us heard anything about season two, right? Like they could be happening, you know, things right. going on all the time. But it just kind of didn't make sense. So yeah. uh, my time to shine was saying basically, could you go into that tweet? Mm-hmm. I'm sorry, yeah, that the season that. Since it's 18 episodes, it's going to be split up into basically like six episode arcs. So mm-hmm. there's literally, he could have just meant that season two is the way that it's going to be split up. Sure. You know what I mean? Either six, either like six episode arcs or two nine. Right, or two nines. Or two nine uh-huh. sets of, you know, right. episodes. Because it could be like season one, two, three, chapter one, two, three. Right. I don't know if we're getting a whole new, like a, like two years of fully of a Daredevil. You yeah. You know what I mean? I mean, if the... If you they space so? it out right, if they drop Daredevil part yeah. part one, they give us another show. Oh, like some other that. shows. And you don't, don't think say, it's just going to? No, I don't. I don't think we're going to wait. Oh, that I, was about to I don't. Say, nah, if they got it all, why wait? So you know, <laughs> that'd unless, be fun though. That'd be. Yeah. But you know, Mark. You know, who they knows what they do that. What they setting yeah. up with these things? So you don't know. But um, yeah. Go ahead. But that, but that you're right. Sorry, but that has to do with the season thing. The other thing is that um because of the the. Wait, where did the mayor thing pop up? That's what I was about to get into. Oh, that was another... That might have been one of them other leakers that was speaking on the mayor stuff. Might have been Divinity Seeker, I think. You know about that? I don't know what you're saying. I'm about to say, there's a... a I know they said... There's, there was something I did read somewhere about how it was supposed to be about... Uh, they were supposed to be know. adapting the Mayor Fisk arc. Yes. From the Charles Soule run. Right. Where do people uh, get this Daredevil. from, though? Is this all just rumors that we're hearing? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, Nothing no, concrete. I think we're not. I think there is kind yeah. of some, at least, no, uh, set pieces. I think I'm right. People on set well, were was, having was the a, signs, right? Yeah, there was a there was a shot or something I saw somewhere. I think there was, like, some signs in the back. There we go. And they're saying that he's running for mayor. For, for mayor. There mm-hmm. we go. So it kind of confirms mm-hmm. it to an extent. Right, 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 right. Yeah. There we go. I just didn't want to make it seem like we were just getting out of thin air. Oh, yeah, I was, yeah, like, yeah, yeah, yeah. I was like, this came from something. Right. Okay. I mean, it's been, you know, little tidbits about this, John, for a little for while a little now. Long. You know what I mean? But yeah, that kind of makes it a little bit more substantial yes. when you're seeing these set set pieces that mm-hmm. corroborate that, that, that thing. Mm-hmm. So, yeah. That information leads us to them speaking on how he will be targeting those street level heroes in the MCU: Hawkeye, Kate Bishop, Spider Man, and Daredevil. Mm-hmm. Punisher probably as well. Jessica Jones yeah. maybe if she pops up. Hey, you about to get yeah? Because Punisher is supposed to be in the show. Yes, so. yes, yes, yes. And apparently a major part of the show. Mm-hmm. These things yeah. are going around. Yeah, yeah. I don't. Which, even... I mean, I'm, I'm always down for. I'm always down for some. Mm-hmm. Matt Murdock, Frank Castle controversy. Yes, me too. Yes, me too. <laughs> I was about to say I like it when they don't like each other. That honestly is the best. I do too. Right? They were talking so crazy in that oh my season. In that, that season of Daredevil. Oh my god, yeah, on we're, we're on that roof. On the roof oh my bro. gosh, not on the roof. <laughs> oh yeah, so Dude, nasty to up. each other. <laughs> <laughs> chained up yeah, I mean, yeah where do you go after that no that's true. true that's true i'm gonna tell you right now one of y'all chains me up on a rooftop and just starts talking crazy to me we ain't friends after this <laughs> no, right. he said right. i bet i'm, I'm gonna say the same anymore. thing <laughs> right same things he said <laughs> no like, seriously no, we, we ain't cool no more so like, no, I'll, I'll, I'll talk with them all. <laughs> <laughs> but no so the question is like how do y'all think this is going to affect the wider street level heroes because we're also even hearing that this could bleed into Spider Man Four, right. in some in type of way. Like, mm-hmm. how do y'all feel about this? Because it seems like I know we're dealing with a lot of multiversal things right now. We're about right. to get cosmic with the Marvels, and it feel like this is bringing us back to the street level mm-hmm. um, yeah. heroes. And to be honest, not to 
break off. To, mm-hmm. to oh add, no, add Go to ahead. your point. Yeah, Sorry, yeah, yeah. Yep. Um, this is all coming out speculatively next year, right? Yeah. So that's with this, yeah. these other street level movies, which is Cap and Thunderbolts, correct? Yeah. Yep. So like they're giving us almost a whole year of street, street level, level things. So it's all, yeah. I don't know. I, I'm kind of excited about it mm-hmm. personally. I don't even have too much to say just because. The concept of all of them connecting, it, like, is yes. kind of dope. That's you know what we're what here, I mean? we here for. That's what I'm that. saying. That's what we're here it's, for. Yeah, yeah. So and, and it's kind of cool being a fan of, like, you know, not that all the Netflix shows that they did with Marvel were were amazing, right? But, like, the concept of them bringing the Defenders actually possibly into the MCU with characters that were already connected with, it's kind of fly. You yeah. know what I mean? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, yeah. like, yeah, I'm into it. Right. Wherever they give it mm-hmm. up. Oh, yeah. yeah. Street level's where I live. So, okay. uh, mm. that's, that, that's how I, like, uh, I'll... I'll be the first person to say it. You, uh, your your comic book universe to me is only as good as your street level superheroes mm-hmm. because they're most relatable. Right. Um, you talking? You know, uh, that's why I always tell people my favorite um, my favorite run of Black Panther was when he was street level. Uh, you know. It's how I love, you know, I like Moon Knight when he's street level, Spider-Man, street level, Daredevil, street level. I mean, yeah, you can let them branch out every now and again, but right. like I think I think a lot of heroes do better when they like go back to basics. Right. Uh when it's when when everything is a world ending threat, then nothing uh is a world ending threat. Come on. So, yeah, no you gotta, yeah. Yeah, you gotta, yeah, you gotta you gotta get back. Cause I mean, you know, at the end of the day, you know, you gotta get back to the neighborhood. You got to get back to the neighborhood. Uh, mm-hmm. And and that's something people can relate to is their neighborhood uh, being under siege. Yeah, yeah, the world ending. Yeah, everybody can get with that too. But like, I mean, you know, if I could look outside my window and see uh, uh, superhero shenanigans, that, that would change my perspective on a lot of things. Mm. Um, so yeah, I want to see that. I want to see, uh, I want to see Daredevil on the street level. Yeah. Uh, but MCU style. Yeah. Yeah. MCU style it. Um, yeah. yeah. I want the hallway fights, but I want it, you know, you throw some updates in there and you, and, and I would even, there's, you know, I, yeah, I tell you the one person I'm disappointed, very disappointed is not, uh, been brought up Uh-oh. in all these, uh, daredevil, uh, you know, boring and, you know, talks or whatever. I know a lot of people are upset that, uh, Karen page, she's not there, but that's not the one I care about. Mm-hmm. Who do you care about? They can keep care. I don't want to know where Turk Baird is. That's what I want to know. I want. I want to know. You say Turk? Is. Come on. I, yeah, hold on. I got to give it up for you for that. I'm sorry. We gonna turn it up too. <laughs> Zen, <laughs> we I don't, I, up too. Ernie, I apologize for interrupting you. Zen did not not say that I need Turk back. Yeah, you did, Ernie. Yeah. We just became closer. I don't even think you know what you just did. <laughs> I need Turk back. I said that. Yes. Where is he? He was the only one connected in all the shows. <laughs> Look, let me tell you something. You know how like they, they were like, man, we need somebody who could be the connective tissue. Yeah, come on. That can bring it all together. Yes. We're gonna make it Karen Page. No, you ain't. It's Turk. <laughs> man, he said, bro. no, you ain't. <laughs> give me give me Turk. <laughs> Cause I'm not gonna lie, you say what you will about the those mm. uh you say what you will about those those Netflix shows. Right, right. But one of my favorite things is just seeing how everybody treated Turk. <laughs> like how <laughs> Turk interacted like with everyone with yes everybody. every single person yes yes <laughs> like on some level like on some level or another he interacted yes. with just about every character and he all he and he interacted with each of them in incredibly different ways yes. punisher probably the most different because he knew <laughs> punisher might kill him yep yep <laughs> yep he was like he's like whoa, whoa, whoa. like like like, that was the first time I actually felt genuine fear for a character in the Netflix universe was when he <laughs> ran up on Punisher. I was like, "Ooh, man, Punisher gonna kill him." Man. Yeah, he just relax. Him. Just relax. Please, you know, well, I mean, look, man, don't 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 kill me. He just trying to. He just, he just a hustler, man. He's like, <laughs> no, for real, man. He probably got some kids. Alone. Just let him let, right. let him go home. Let him look, let him look, man. <laughs> like, man, that's Turk, man. That's Turk, man. <laughs> <laughs> like he just about so many things. The neighborhoods are already. Just let him buy. Just let him buy. Right. <laughs> let him buy. But no. <laughs> I, but I'm for real though. I'm for real though. I I want like I you. I will say this. Either bring back uh uh either bring back Eldon Henson as Foggy or don't. I don't care. But Foggy Nelson does need to be there because Matt Murdock is just a weird guy without Foggy Nelson. Mm. Uh, but I don't need to see Karen Page. Mm. Karen Page. 
I've never liked. And that is nothing against Deborah Ann Wall. I've never liked Karen Page as a character. A lot of people uh, say this. Yeah, yeah. We, that is pretty like <laughs> we've been hearing that. She, yeah. She's milk toast. She's milk toast. She she she's nobody. Matter of fact, we live in a we live in a we we live in a Kirsten McDuffie era. There's no excuse to be going back to Karen Page after we've had Kirsten McDuffie. Get that blonde woman up out my show. <laughs> they, I don't want to see her. I'm hearing that's I'm hearing Kirsten. some some uh Uh-oh. one of the one of the set pictures that came out was Matt and a woman walking from a courtroom black, that was the black yes woman, right? yeah i'm hearing people mm-hmm. saying that that that's what she that's is. who she is yeah oh she might be she, she, allegedly. Allegedly. she might Ooh. be because it, it was really weird so that is kind of one of my biggest issues with Kirsten mcduffie actually is that i know for a fact that i think she's white but like they always drew her as ethnically ambiguous mm-hmm. <laughs> in gotcha. the comics like right, sometimes right. she was white sometimes she was kind of mocha just kind of depend on who was on colors that week. Gotcha. <laughs> <laughs> That's funny. Oh, you're me, man. Yeah, oh. I mean, you know, I mean, I'm just saying what it is, you know. But um, so yeah, I would personally, if they made Kirsten McDuffie black, I would not be upset about it in the slightest. And if for whatever reason Matt was trying to get him a cup of brown sugar, yeah, right. I ain't Come mad on. at him either. Give let himself, let that man. A sister. <laughs> Look, yes. hey, let that man. He sees no color. Blind. He seen green. He. <laughs> we can't green. do this because now I want to reference Ray Charles, and it's not good. Like I'm not supposed to do that, you know. Like now they got to get Jamie to play Matt Murdock. <laughs> oh my <laughs> Jamie as Matt Murdock is a it's wild. Nuts. That's a wild variant. That's a crazy variant. That's a wild man. variant. Oh, while he's Electro, there's things going on in this. In this right. Bring him the Secret Wars. <laughs> oh goodness. Wait, so so I like it here. We're gonna kill the variant. We're gonna yeah. A variant of, 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 of Matt Murdock played by Jamie Foxx. <laughs> and he still got some of his electricity, though. Don't forget about it. It's still in his chest. It's still in his yeah, chest. Yeah, just a little bit. Every now and then it comes out. I'm electro. <laughs> oh, God. Oh, my but God. No, but no, I, but yeah, all, all that say, yeah, I, I, w- I would love to see, uh, if, if you bring back any other character from the, uh, the Marvel Netflix universe, uh, please, please let it be Turk Barrett, please. Nah, seriously, that actually would be yeah. really dope. Yeah. <laughs> That's so, no, nah, like, it's not a joke. I don't think they would. He was well, such a great, no good. joke, he was a great actor, though. So I don't, I could, like, oh, see them. Fantastic. Like, he's amazing, you know? Mm-hmm. Like, they might bring him back. You never know. You really never know. I've seen Rob, Mor- the, the guy who plays his name's uh, Rob Morgan. I've seen yes. him in tons yes. of movies and TV shows. Incredible. That dude is always good. Yep. I don't care what, even if it's a bad movie or TV show, like, he's yep. usually the one good thing in it because he's just that, that brother is you real never lied there i respect him i don't I know if you've ever seen mudbound like mudbound is very <laughs> good he's not great in that okay yes no, I'm right let, with let, you. That, let that man get that mcu money yeah, yeah, please man. right like, nah, come bro, on bro. man i feel so happy for a lot of these actors me too that's like coming from these other properties that now are kind of getting folded into the mcu yeah because like really i know cool them checks is nice i know it right the difference oh. right yeah man <laughs> and it's like yo we could go to the premieres now like yeah, it's nah, different. Is... like we in, we still in, we in the family yeah. still you know nah, what I, mean? like, I bet charlie like, cox is probably so happy every day like he don't even care what the script is low-key because he's just like bro i'm back like they really got me back here. you oh, know yeah. what i mean and that's awesome. And he played the long con. He Ooh, played the long con. The long he knew. Yep. Yes, yeah. he did. He knew. Yeah. Didn't like, he, didn't they, he uh, remember. reject roles and stuff? I right? think he might have. I think he yeah. did. Wow. Yeah, because he, he basically, Mar- like, is it, he actually implied that he knew, like, that Marvel had had talks with him wow. since mm. Daredevil was canceled. Like, him and Vincent D'Onofrio. Wow. And there were some other actors that said that they kind of had gotten wind of some things too back when everything was getting canceled. But uh, because I think uh, is Jessica Henwick, yeah, yeah, Colin Wynn, yep, he kind of implied when the Matrix was coming out that that was kind of why she she took she she went the Matrix route, yes, that that's her fault, right? Uh, but. I wish she'd have stayed because she was the only good thing that came out of uh, Iron Fist other right. than Typhoid Mary. I she, mean, there's rumor. You told me you heard, heard a little something. No, I did. And mm-hmm. also because they asked her in an interview about that. And she yeah. did say something to like, yo, at the end of the series, she did have the the fist. Man, I'm going to need yeah, you one had, day. She, at the end of the show. I'm a, if mm-hmm. she comes back as the Iron Fist, though, I'm going to lose it. She and she did phenomenal. say, because then they offered, if I'm wrong, 
Correct me in the comments or something, but uh, yeah. <laughs> no, I, if I'm not mistaken, let me look it up. We got a computer here, but I, I could have sworn that she said uh, that she turned down a role in Shang Chi. Yeah, she because did. of that's that. what it was. Yeah, 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 yeah right. Because she thought that she there was still she a wanted chance, to keep that, right? that 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 open, open that she could still mm-hmm. come back as as Colleen. Whoa, and and honestly, I ain't mad at her. Right, I'm I'm I I mean personally. I have the sneaky suspicion she probably would have had Aquafina's role. I would have rather that, no. Been that's Jessica exactly Hinwick. yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah. I feel like I feel like Jessica Hinwick would have would have would have. She would have. Don't get me wrong. No hate towards Aquafina. I'm sure she's a nice person, but yeah, she's my least favorite part of that movie. <laughs> 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 that said, uh, no. Nah, if I could get Jessica Hinwick back as Kali Wing, even better. But yeah, um, yeah. If you're gonna bring me anybody. If you're gonna bring me anybody back, uh, you know, I, I, you know, bring back Jessica Jones. I'm perfectly fine with that. You bring back uh, Mike Coulter uh, as Luke Cage. I'm fine with that. Uh, let him be. Uh, was Boss Cage? Can he be Boss Cage from season two? Let, <laughs> right. let, let, let that play out. <laughs> can we get that? Can we get the the, the follow up to that? Because that could have been something. That could have been but, something. Uh, yeah. yeah, that was good. But yeah, they, they just—it's the multiverse. Just it right, is, it might is. as well just throw them all in the <laughs> little. Yo, mix, I feel right. like we have this conversation every episode because about it's like the damn is it multiverse? It does like it. Does said. it? Yeah. Is is Daredevil stuff? Is that canon? Like, is it not? Uh, Are they keeping things? It's what about does it to mean? get real tricky because if I see Jessica Jones ass pop up, but then I don't see like Michael Coulter and it's another person, I'm gonna be so confused. It'll be weird. Like, they just have to explain it well. Like, even if it's just, hey, by the way, multiverse. Like, sure, but, like, say it then. (laughs) You know? Like, they're going to have to have a line or something that makes this make sense. Or we're just going to all be so confused. Unless unless they just, yeah. I was going to say, unless they just bring them in Secret Secret Wars, low-key. You just throw Mike Coulter in there and then that makes sense. Like, oh, now he's here. So he was, that was a different one. Oh, like, the whole time. That would be insanity. And we just wait 10 years and I'm like, oh, okay. So y'all, okay, we were supposed to know. But we did y'all didn't tell us. Okay, we got it. <laughs> got it. See, my my whole thing is like you do it like uh you, you can even do it like Hulk and uh well, She Hulk. There we go. Like, oh man, I was a different person back then. Just man, both <laughs> literally, right? Literally. They said the word literally, yeah, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Uh huh. Uh huh. That honestly <laughs> works enough for me though. That works for a me too. nice yeah. little joke. If yeah. the tone is right, yeah, go ahead. Yeah, yeah. but say it, something, it, y'all. It's the delivery. <laughs> yeah, it's the delivery. Yeah, because yeah. it was it was because it was just something he just kind of threw in there. Because I think they even said that was an ad lib. Like he just added that in there. No in way. The Is that real? Yeah. That and was, they that allowed it to go. They oh. let it go. Yeah. <laughs> They're funny for that. No, because I mean, li- yeah, you got. You got comedians writing this shit, so yeah, they're they're like, oh yeah, dude, go, just go ahead and go off. Go no, off. Right. This is almost a whole new topic. I'm not trying to say long, but that's <laughs> interesting that they let that fly. If they let's, I'm being hypothetical, not saying that Edward Norton mm. would pop up, but like, let's say he pops up in Secret Wars, they got to make a new joke about that. They do, like, literally, they got to go back on the joke. So yeah. I'm like, that's crazy. Y'all would do that one, you right, know what I right, mean? Right. I'm interested to see. They just call it like Hulk twenty. 20- 2013 or something like that. Like, yeah, right, right. Hulk like, from Earth 2013. There you go. Something. Right. Like, are you the old me? <laughs> <laughs> like, I seen you before. Was that in my mirror? I don't know what's going on. You were dream, you were dream walking. <laughs> yes, there we go. There we go. Well, oh, that's here you go. I'll give you this one for free. Marvel, you can have an Earth 2008. That's where you can put Ghost Rider yes. and, and Hulk and, yes. and all that. Honestly, wow, that's yeah. what they need to do. They do, <laughs> and, and look at, they can just survive after the sequel. You know what I mean? And look at that. Look mm-hmm. at look at what we got first on the on the movie versus that that lines up. Whoa. You don't even know what you just did. Oh wow, <laughs> it was say. meant to be. <laughs> <laughs> yes, but yeah, but yeah, that was all our topics so far for today. But uh, yeah, we do a little movie versus. Uh, where we just put these two movies together and pick what, in our opinion, is the are. better movie. Do yeah. we have a theme this time? I think we just went nah, randomized, right? It is a little randomized. We got two, but they're very interesting. Yeah, so one superhero, one, 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 like just regular movie. Cool. Yes, you want to. Okay. All right, yeah, this should be fun. So, what you just said, nice little transition. Yeah, yeah, right. The Incredible Hulk from which one was it? 2008. It was 2008 versus Ghost Rider. The first Ghost Rider with Nicolas Cage in 2007. Yeah. yeah. Mm hmm. So man, man, I'll go first. I don't know. Ah, I mean, I'll, I'll swing. I'll go ahead, swing. go ahead, bro. Uh, if y'all would have said Ghost Rider Spirit of Vengeance, I would have picked that because that would be so stupid. That, like it's uh, it, that's amazing for you. It, 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 yeah, it's so stupid that I love it. <laughs> <laughs> that's a great Ghost reason Rider to Spirit trust. Vengeance. 
It's it's, it's crazy. Dumb. Yeah. It's dumb. It's bad. <laughs> now, Ghost Rider, also dumb. But yes. it's trying really hard to be serious. Ah, yeah, there we is. go. It and, does. And it, sometimes it, it gives you a little yeah. something, right? Mm-hmm. Yeah, Spirits of Vengeance knew what it was and leaned into it. The first one, they weren't in on the joke. They weren't <laughs> in on the joke, and I do not like that movie. So I, by default, uh, Incredible Hulk. <laughs> Honestly, that's a great movie. No, it's a great reason. Great reason. Yeah. You want to go second? I go second. Um, I recently just watched Ghost Rider again. Um, after a very long time, and I, I agree with you. I do like that Ghost Rider movie, but yeah. if we go in better movie, I'm gonna go with the Hulk. Incredible Hulk. Yeah, mm-hmm. Dead and Jones, Yeah. I feel like I have to just give it bail. You know what, Nicholas Cage? We love you. We do. That's my answer. Because it's <laughs> the Incredible Hulk. So. Yeah. Yeah. I hope we getting back though as a variant or something. Nick Wait Cage. a second. Huh? This is the first Incredible Hulk, isn't it? Not the Edward Norton one. No, nah, this is the the no, nah, this is the Edward Norton one. Oh yeah, then yeah, Norton. Edward Norton. Yeah, because the first one was just called Hulk. Yeah. There we go. Right. That was when Eric Bana was uh, yeah. right. uh playing the uh, now. If tier. it was those two, yeah. I think it's a little more tricky. Really figuring it out because they're both not great. True. That no. Hulk versus Ghost Rider. Yeah. You know what I mean? Yeah, yeah. I would. Ooh, man. Whew. See, That's isn't it? Really I'm better. Ooh. I'm. Hey, we, you know what? On the spot, we switching it. There we go. <laughs> Rethink it, y'all. Now, let's now let's see. This, this first, this first in history. Said, uh-huh. If you said the Ang Lee Hulk movie versus Ghost Rider, I would pick Ghost Rider. <laughs> see, that, that Hulk movie it's is horrible. rough. Yeah, no, it's not oh, a good. Oh, that Hulk movie hurts. That Hulk oh. movie hurts. It, it, that Hulk movie breaks my heart. It is. <laughs> That look, movie is egregiously bad. Yes, <laughs> yes. Hey, look, we got we got Ghost Rider some bail. We did. Look, we did. <laughs> Nicholas Cage. It we did that out. for you. We, we love did it for you, you. man. Yes, Nicholas Cage. <laughs> I hope they yeah. get you to do the Spider Man uh, Noir show because because I go. I need it. That's what I need. Uh, do we? Oh, you uh, <laughs> Yes, we do. Get get out of here. Okay, <laughs> this next one is actually. Pretty tricky. Whoa. Is this the first one for the first movie? Ooh. Yeah. Yep. Okay. F- f- Pirates of the Caribbean too. versus The Matrix. That's this is the first high one. So yeah, one first on for both the of those. Yeah. The That's actually movie. kind of insanity. Yeah. Wow. Look at man. us. That was a good one. Oh, man. Um, I'm going to. Oh, my God. I don't want to go first. <laughs> it's, that's kind of hard. I might go. I I'll go first. Go. You I'll go first. I'll go first. Break that ice. Break that ice. I'm going to go with The Matrix. Okay. I just recently watched the first Pirates movie, okay. and it was good. Is that Black Pearl? Which one is that? That's Black Pearl. Curse okay. of Black Pearl. Yeah, I do yeah. be getting confused sometimes, but right. yeah, uh, yeah, that's the, the Curse of the Black Pearl. Um, I just love that <laughs> that first Matrix movie, man. I think to me that first Matrix movie is the best Matrix movie out of all of them, you personally. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So like, I just have an attachment to that one. Okay, um, that's fair. and I do think it's. I mean, it was groundbreaking when it came. You know what I mean? Like, oh, it's, it's a it's a good joint. Well, one I mean, of a I kind. Copied for like the next like 15, 20 years. Exactly. Exactly. Yep, exactly. Yep, yep. That, if that don't show that you were revolutionary, I don't know what will. Like, yeah, you know, ain't nobody copying piss poor movies. Yeah. Right. Right. Uh, that's right. Like Bullet Time was in everything. Everything. Mm. From Shrek to to wow. Charlie's Angels to True. Scary yeah. Movie and yes. all those everything after that yep. literally in Shrek. That's, Everybody that's wanted to be the Matrix. <laughs> right. Everybody, every crazy. action movie wanted to be the Matrix. Yeah, yeah, they killed that. Now, not the not the thorny shots of Pirates of the Caribbean because that's a great movie mm-hmm. and it still holds up uh, VFX wise to this day. Like those scenes yeah. when they're switching. I'm gonna say you, you giving us some my reasons. Skeleton yeah, and uh-huh. human on the, like that's yeah. still no, like, looks people good. People low key need to go back to. To that and look at that. Oh, it's oh, fantastic. Yeah. It's yeah. kind of I, nice I love, yeah, yeah, yeah. I love two out of the five Pirates movies. Mm-hmm. Is there five? Uh, <laughs> yeah, did y'all remember he had a he had a solo one? Um, Johnny yeah. Depp, remember they, on Stranger Tides? It was, it was, I didn't know that. It was so, Black yeah. Pearl. There was the uh, um, was the Dead Man, Dead Man, Dead Man's Chess. That man's chest. Yeah, that man's then chest you got World's End or something like that. End and World's End. Then it's on Stranger Tides. Then it's uh. And then uh, Dead Men Tell Dead Men Tell No Tales, yeah. That's wow. the last one. okay. I can't even believe I remembered that subtitle. Yeah. Um, <laughs> but yeah, I like two, actually I tell you about, I like two and a half Pirates of the Caribbean movies uh, out of those five. And the first one is one of them. Yeah. Uh, but I like The Matrix more, so. Yeah, that's fair. Matrix I'm- was, um, Matrix was, was revolutionary. Um, it was revolutionary. It was in, you know, say what you will about the sequels that came after, uh, which all kind of, uh, 
The graded quality. <laughs> each one. <It> just, yeah. <laughs> With each one. Yeah. yeah, I can't even tell you what happened in the, was last, the fourth one. Same, bro. Uh, Zen hates it. it. I, I, no, I, you know, I, you know, I tell you what. The first time I saw it, I fell asleep. Oh, not asleep. And in I, I woke up and the movie was like the credits were rolling. Uh. <laughs> I passed out somewhere in the middle of I was like, this is, I was like, Mm. No, I'm done. Was it was um, it a good night? I went though? back and tried to watch it, couldn't finish it. Uh so yeah, oh, I man. do not like that movie either. Um and, and I got called all kinds of uh uh <laughs> Hey man, you couldn't you couldn't get into it. <laughs> this what it is. Yeah, right. The movie is bad because a okay director did not want to make a movie, and they made a movie about how badly they did not want to make that movie. Oh, my goodness. And that is why that movie sucks. If you look at the subtext of the movie, it's basically about not wanting to make a movie uh, based on a beloved franchise. It, it, did, it was very it, Wow, well, you're making me really meta. think about it. The meta, and then, all the it was Warner like, Brothers making stuff. a sequel, and then oh, it's like, yep. right. Keanu was working at the studio for the game, and it was like, mm-hmm. this is like connected to the thing. It was a lot of meta, oh, wow. meta yeah. stuff in there, yeah. It, it, it was that movie was literally about not wanting to make that movie. That's literally what it was about. It was that's really weird when you think of like, yeah. the first one. Right. Just like what yeah. this is, like this yeah. world is yeah. not that. Like how far right. we've come. How far we've come. Right? Like, is it Deadpool? Like, what is the what is the movie? I'm like trying to get the tone. Yeah. Because when you say it out loud instead of actually watching it, it sounds like a comedy. You right. know what I mean? And I, and I and it's crazy that we here. I was trying to really get into it when I'm watching it, doing, and yeah. I'm like, we get to the end, and I'm like, this is where we end up after all of this. I, I don't this even remember there? that. Right? Yeah. It's just okay. Whatever. It's just y'all really didn't know what to do after that first one. They did it. <laughs> really like every did time get lost. I see a Matrix movie, yeah, so like a sequel. That's what I say. I'm like, man, y'all really had. No I just plan. hold that first maybe, one close. Maybe to me. Will Smith. <laughs> maybe Will Smith missed the bullet. Maybe. Remember, he was supposed to be uh, Neo. He was. Mm-hmm. That's crazy. I honestly, I think Neo. I know he said that it was like something he regretted. Nah. <laughs> He's like mm, you dodged the bullet. The more I think about it, right? <laughs> yeah. 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 I'm I'm glad mm-hmm. I'm glad Keanu survived that because he you know yeah. that was his thing for Partially a while. Partially watched it for as, him too, you know. Yeah, right. Now Partially. he got John Wick, so you know. Yeah, look at that. Yeah, it all works no. out. <laughs> yeah, I'm riding the John Wick till the he wheel what? Off. My man don't even got to say words now. He's good for life. <laughs> he barely says anything. He goes, "My dog." <laughs> yeah, my dog. Like, and then you die. And that's really there's right. all <laughs> not many things. He and then do. you see he brought I'm Lawrence back. Fishburne with him. He right, he did bring Lawrence Fishburne with him. Yeah. Wow! Like he—he he literally like everyone just talks around him, right? That's yeah. what everybody does in John Wick. That's actually he's true. Like, fight, and then everyone else talks. Yes, <laughs> is it? I'm gonna wait for y'all to finish. Can I kill somebody? Now? <laughs> <laughs> like, <laughs> which I mean, to be fair, I uh, oh, I got no problem with it. Oh yeah, keep yeah, it yeah, going. I, look, as long as I can keep look, the quality no, no, high, no keep what? the quality where it's at. I'm with. I keep make ten of them. I'm cool with you it. You can keep turn watching. John Wick into the new James Bond where it's like I'm thinking that too. Really though, no, I think Ooh. you can. That's not a yeah. joke. Yo, you you, you can, can you spin off that thing to this they just keep spinning. You see they turn. You can even they, it don't even have to be new characters. It could literally be the same dude. Like just when when Keanu Reeves is aged out, just bring somebody, somebody else. Yeah, in. wow. You, you just never keep lie. the magic going. Yeah. And like I like this. I, I, I would I would watch it. I, I, that, like, like when I'm 80 years old, like you know, <laughs> hanging out with my great grandchildren, however many, whatever. Right, like you but, ain't seen you know, the first one. Like, oh, you don't know nothing about that old John. <laughs> <laughs> Well, back in my day, <laughs> he, can, Reeves, he used a horse in the one that I saw. A horse in a book. <laughs> <laughs> Did you know they killed his first dog? <laughs> I'm about to lose myself, yo. <laughs> now why am I envisioning Ernie's life when he's older? This is too much. I'm seeing his grandkids and stuff. You don't got no grand- like, I don't know what's going on, man. <laughs> This is too much. Oh, oh man. Okay. I just, I just I see it happening. I just I could I could literally That's see it happening. That's a phenomenal my, idea. Man. No. My kids just being like, and, I see. Uh, it. Like it's like dude, it's like shut up, Granddad. My, my John Wick now got aliens. Like my shut job, up. My John Wick got aliens. It's crazy. <laughs> That's nuts. 
Yeah. Uh, John Wick in the multiverse. <laughs> oh my god. Weakness. There's Seth's multiverse of weakness is crazy. <laughs> <laughs> they got Nardo Wick in there too. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, we gotta get off there. We gotta get off there. He's speaking about Nardo Wick. Oh goodness. Not not not, not trap stars getting into John Wick. I mean, it's, it's that's a, they that might be a variant. It might be a variant. In this you, universe. Ernie, no. Ernie, we appreciate you coming on. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> I don't know why, but but the the rap fan of me wanted to do the do the song. That, if y'all gotta, yeah. No, they played in the multi. No, he who, who is that? About? You know the, who the, is that? And then he yeah, looked but, around and it's Keanu and it's okay. Nardo Wick. No, no, no. Because now I'm thinking every rapper that talks about guns got to be in like a John Wick movie. This is gonna this is deteriorating the brand. <laughs> deteriorating the brand. This is not good. Like I don't know if Lil Baby's supposed to be in John Wick Seven. You know what I'm saying? I don't know. I don't know. I mean, look, it, look. If, if Bad Bunny, if Bad Bunny could be an action star, Bad Bunny could be. The you next know what? You ain't never lied because Bad Bunny was year. fire and Bullet Train, and he didn't have to oh, say yeah. any no words. To me. That was Nothing. great, though. I'm glad they picked that. Yeah, I'm glad they said, "Yo, do you don't have to talk, bro? Look, just yeah. fight." I'm just, I'm just yeah. ready for him to to be El Muerto. I'm ready for him to be the next big major Marvel hero. You know, That's what I want. you know, it's crazy. Look, I don't just... know if you being for real or not because I do kind of want it, but I know I don't want it. You know, <laughs> like, do you want it? <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I know it's gonna be terrible, <laughs> but you gonna watch it, right? Like, I'm gonna pay too. Like, I didn't even pay for Morbius, but I might pay for this. Right? I might, you know. Dude, let me tell you something. I walked into Morbius knowing good to hell well that movie was gonna be some hot <laughs> trash. I walked into that movie. I knew it was gonna be bad. I didn't know it was gonna be that bad. Though. Right, as bad as it was, though. Yeah, I'm hoping they. they I'm hoping. They, I hope. I'm hoping no more. So if they, if that's even still happening, because we don't know. Yeah, that's yeah. true. That it might but, be a sleeper. Who knows? If they no, take some chances, hey, not like for real. I'm hoping it is. I'm not saying that it will be. Well, where the hope come from? Like, <laughs> I don't know. Like what place in your? I just want body? Sony to do well. I guess kind of because they've been giving well, us so many bad movies. I also so want a million dollars. I don't know how close <laughs> I'm about to get to it, but that's uh, true. You talking I mean, about Sony the with the El Muerto doing good? Like, Which is, man, y'all could have made a Prowler movie, but y'all chose El Muerto. Y'all made some choices. <laughs> And don't even well, get uh, started on say, the Donald Glover. Do you know you know about his movie? I'm so mad at him. I don't even want to talk about this no more. I'm saying, <laughs> oh goodness, because like, what's bro, his movie? They what's say he called them. No, he did to make them. <laughs> no, no, no. Do you mean for real? Bro, for this movie, or did he call like, hey y'all, I want to do something, and they were like, we've got a great idea for you. Like, no, no, wonder? this was his idea because his music related. Yeah. He, that's why he wanted to do it. I'm old. He's like, it was like it was like El Muerto. I'm like, dude. Who knows who he is? I mean, granted, that's fair. No one knew who the Guardians of the Galaxy were either. True, but you know what? You are it was like spin. five okay. people. All right, it was five people. There were five people who knew the Guardians of the Galaxy were, <laughs> and half of them created the Guardians of the Galaxy. Uh, <laughs> like, I remember when I first saw the trailer, I was like, "Don't none of you." I was like, "Ooh, I know who that is." Stop! I, I literally <laughs> turned on my feet. Stop! You lying! Stop! You don't know who they are. I barely know who they are. <laughs> right. <laughs> No, nah, you're right though. Me. It could work out. It's just like I'm scared. It's Sony, me. man. Yes. I just don't trust them. Yeah, I don't. Like, if anything, if it ain't animated, I don't I know. Want I, more, don't I want no. more hope for um Madam Web than I want hope for El Muerto. At least it's going to connect to something. Web was coming out. Exactly. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Like, at least it's going to connect. Is El Muerto continuing? Like, was this a one? What is this? Is this a one off? I just don't know what they said. No, what is this going towards? That's my thing. That's what I'm saying. This is the- more wrestling Spider Man movies. Spider, like this is this is the, the this is the Spider Verse. Spooder Verse. Sony Spooder Verse. This ain't this is the boot. This is the bootleg universe. This ain't <laughs> the real Spider Verse. This is like like yo. Let me tell you something. You, oh. want, you want to know how you can tell the quality of a film when you see made in association with Marvel. That should tell you that this ain't going to be. Take the expectations <laughs> and bring them down. Bring them on Bring them down. This is going to sound like real nasty work. Like, a civilian shouldn't even speak about things like this, but this is made by all these things. Just buy everybody. Just buy them all. So then we don't even got to be talking about this no more. Yeah. Once Disney owns it all, man. <laughs> hey, man. I work for you. I know I'm sound like I'm promoting a monopoly, but I need... I, I, I'm I need, promoting a I monopoly. Need, I need better movies. Caesar's man. views I, don't express all views of Listen 3000. But... <laughs> <laughs> It's like blur me out. You know what I mean? What was the hey, hey, what, what, what was Victoria Alonzo's role? Uh, president, <laughs> president of production, production. Yeah. I can do that. Yeah. Right. You know, you know, you can sign me up. Yeah. I learned yeah. today. <laughs> but oh uh, man, this was an awesome episode. Yeah, this was too much fun. Oh dude, thank you. Thank you for having me. Thank, thank you, you for man. Having me. Oh, man. Thank you. Yes. 
one more time. Um, but yeah, no, seriously, we, we can't thank you enough for for coming on. Um, definitely with the second second go around. Yeah, yeah, so yeah. I appreciate you. <laughs> yeah, for sure. Yeah, you know, it's yeah, just it's, it's multiverse, man. It's there we go. Universe. It is. This it is, is a variant yeah. episode. That was another there we go. Yeah, yeah. you would never lie. That's all it was. <laughs> so, but before we get out of here, Ernie, if you want to plug all your stuff, let everybody know where to find you at, and uh, yeah. Yeah. Um. Yeah. You can find me on uh, YouTube.com forward slash uh, Blur Without Fear. Uh, you can pretty much find me everywhere for the most part. Uh, Blur Without Fear. If you just type it in, I'm sure I'll pop up somewhere. Uh, but yeah, I put out new videos uh, every week. Uh, you know, sometimes two, sometimes three, sometimes a lot more than any human being probably should. And uh, yeah, I live stream every Saturday. Uh, 1 p.m. East. Or, oh, yeah, it's actually, yeah, 1 p.m. Eastern, 10 a.m. Pacific every Saturday. Um, uh, and we got a uh, not this week, but next week we have our 200th uh blurred cape coming up. Oh, wow, awesome! And we got a special guest that's uh, gonna be joining us. I want to go ahead and say it now. It's not comics, it's playing. He's out of town. <laughs> okay, <laughs> I know everybody's like, Man, you're gonna bring Rob. Like, you are you gonna get Rob? No, it's not Rob. It's just, uh, <laughs> just throwing it out there, letting you know. <laughs> I, I, I don't want anybody to get excited. Come, man! I heard, I heard Rob's gonna be on the 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 two hundred episode earlier. No, he's not. He already told me. <laughs> he told me no. He told me no. He, he said he said he said he would do the one after. Just, okay, okay, <laughs> lovely. that's good. Lovely. lovely compromise. Yes, <laughs> lovely compromise. But no, uh, but yeah, that that's everything, man. Uh, yeah, just uh, go go to my channel and click the buttons, and yeah. There you go. Definitely, definitely. Beautifully said. Thank you again, man. <laughs> and, um, hey, yeah, thank man. you. Thank you. Like yeah. I said, it was, a, it was a pleasure. I had a great time. And uh, I was so sad last time that we didn't get to finish the uh, conversation. Yes. Right. <laughs> oh, <laughs> my God. We did the show before. So I was like, oh, yeah, dude, definitely. I was like, oh, I, was like I like y'all. Like, <laughs> thank you, man. We, we appreciate that. Bro. We do appreciate it. Yeah. We really do. But yeah, um, this yeah, was Listen 3000. Yes, um, this is also Agents of Fandom Podcast. Just one more time. Uh, make sure you Always. check out agentsoffandom.com. And uh, some great articles on there. They post and stuff every day. Yes. So shout out to the team and get 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 up on the new news that's going on. You know, these do definitely. So yeah, we'll be back very soon. And uh, this was listen three thousand.